This is Legs. She is my, whoops, Choco Golden Me, aka Grandma Stola Pole Cripes. She's out and about. Let's see if she wants a super worm. Probably not. She hasn't been eating well the past, well, really, since <laughs> she's been bred, she hasn't been eating well. Teaser into oh, did you get it, baby? Take it out. Take it out. You got it. She did get it. <laughs> Good girl. Good girl, legs. You can see it kind of um there. This is my Lossiodora Parahibana, suspected female. I don't know if she actually wants food. I guess she does. Good job, girl. She's pretty big, too. She's about seven inches, I'd say. I'm trying to see my hand. <laughs> I don't want to get my hand too close, but uh, she's she's bigger than my hand. Look what I have! It's a molt. She is so beautiful. Oh my gosh! Let's see if I can zoom in even more. Oh my gosh, she is so lovely. This is Emma, my Brachypelma Smithy. And she has surprised me with a uh, molt, as you can see. Right there. Um, it's still soft, so I'm not going to feed her. It she couldn't have molted more than probably less than a day. She is super pretty, so have a good look. Sweet. I wasn't expecting that. Here is, um, The tarantula molt. This is how perfect it is. Uh, next to a catch cup. And a super worm container. Y'all know how big that is. So that's how big she was. And um, nice tongs. So she's got to be at least five, five and a half inches. She's she's a big girl now. As soon as I <laughs> open the lid, this girl came out to see what was going on. Um, so I'm going to be fairly convinced she's hungry. All right, Marilyn, here we go. See if she does something crazy. Good girl. Should I feed her too? I think I'm going to offer her another one. Yeah, she wanted it. I think I'm going to name her Marilyn. <clears throat> yes, Marilyn, I'm naming <laughs> this uh, Nandu after you because every time I look at her, I keep thinking of you and fruitcake. So, and this is just a spectacular bird eating spider. I mean, it's so beautiful. If you ask me, it's got to be one of the prettiest bird eaters. 
Anyway, we'll let her enjoy her meal. It is female. This gorgeous uh, girl or boy, have no idea which, is a um, regalis, and I'm just gonna toss. The Holy. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I didn't curse that time, but she did surprise me because I recently fed her a uh, palmetto bug that I found, and I was not expecting her to want that quite as much as she apparently did. Well, she wants that one too. I hope it's a girl. If any of y'all know how to dorsally sex pokies, hint, hint, John, 3800, um, I would love to know if you suspect male or female. Just going to get that other one, but I uh, don't think I'm going to get it on camera. get a quick shot of this girl because as soon as I move her tank <laughs> she's probably gonna bolt behind her hide. This is a Pocotheria ornata about a four inch specimen. I'm very well aware that the light is off however this is an escape artist pokey as we all know. <laughs> Panic there on my part. And I do not want her trying to eat me or escape. There she is. I think she got them both. No, the other one's down here. She hasn't noticed it yet, and I am not sticking my tongs in there, so... Uh, that's what you get, sweetie. I'm sorry. I, I'd like it to be more, but... <sighs> there you go. A little bit better light. Not a whole lot. Legs of the OBT. About all I ever see of it. Hardly ever anymore. Um, and I'm taking this just in case she ducks when I open the lid. This little cutie pie is the Aftapelma something something Arizona Gold. I swear I have dropped about... That one just jumped, jumped right in where I wanted it, so... Except the tea doesn't <laughs> seem to be terribly interested. We can't get it to go closer. And that's right behind you. Good lord, how lazy is this guy? Pretty lazy. <sighs> okay, at least I got eight this time. Okay, people, I want to show you something. See this uh, butt on the tarantula? And this doesn't seem to me like it's coming out very well, but it is absolutely dark. She's going to molt very soon. You do not want to feed a tarantula when its butt looks like that. The reason why is, let's say you put something like a cricket in there. Tarantula molts, it's very defenseless for the first 24, 48 hours. Uh, could actually be eaten or killed by crickets. So, whenever you see a tarantula butt like that, do not feet it. She's cute. I can't wait to see uh, 
what she's going to turn out like and verify her by molt as female. Another gorgeous female. This one is a um, Rocky Palma Bomi. Look how beautiful she is. Let's see if she's interested in a super worm. Maybe. I don't really want to lose another super worm, so. Come on, girl. I think they scare them sometimes, so I'm actually going to drop some crickets in here and see if I get a better reaction. I have noticed that at times they tend to prefer one prey item over another. I'm going to just drop one in and let it be because if she's not really going after it, she's probably not all that hungry. She is beautiful though. This is my super, super sweet uh, Brachypelma elbow pelosum, the Honduras curly leg. Completely uninterested in this super worm. Believe me, I've seen her when she is interested in eating, and that is not the reaction you get. She is so cute. I love her. This is a uh, princess, my grandma Stola Pokra. Sometimes she eats really well, sometimes she doesn't. Today she's eating well. She'll get that other cricket later. Probably when it rolls past her. See if I can encourage it along. Come on, cricket. Yes, your dinner. You don't want to be late for your dinner date, do you? Yes, I didn't think you did. Uh, I think I'm just going to leave it at two. Because her abdomen's already pretty big. So beautiful. This is Carlita, and she's been pacing her cage all day. I'm assuming she's hungry. Yeah, she's hungry. She's been fussy the last couple of feeding videos. But I guess, you know, everybody gets hungry eventually. So I'm going to see if she wants a second one. Because like I said, she's been pacing. Yeah. And sometimes she's like that, you know. She'll uh, ignore food for a while and then she really wants to eat. And she does not like her cage to be watered. <laughs> I do it anyway, but uh, she does not like it. She buries it and uh, webs over it at times. It's crazy. And usually when I feed them, I go ahead and add water. But right now she's decided she's eating over her water dish. So, uh, yeah, I guess I'll have to do her later. GBB got one of the crickets. I I managed to see the attack, but now it's just doing the web up thing. There's one more in there. You know it's gonna get it. <laughs> but uh, so pretty. I thought you'd want to see that. And here's the my Pocotheria uh, striata. Trying to get a good angle for you. 